Hi guys, I'm Mar, and today, whew, finally, I cannot believe I'm actually sitting down and shooting this video. I've been trying to do this video for months, honey months. When I started working on this video, I was actually allowed outside my house. So this, I can't call it a shopping adventure. I can't call it a shopping trip. This is a full on shopping marathon. This is a full length feature film because it's taken that long. Yes, Wish, I'm looking at you. And you wanna know the worst part is that I I have not even received all of my items. I'm still waiting. Clock is ticking, but I'm just like, you know what? I'm not one to wait for no man, and I'm definitely not one to wait for no website. Unless we're talking legit, at least 50% off sales, but of the real item, not the wish version item. You know what I mean? When there's an expectation for what you're about to receive, and then you get the reality, and you're just like, was it worth waiting all those months? It wasn't. And you just sit there filled with regret. But wish actually got a whole lot of hacks, so let's get right into it. Hack number one. You can actually go to the Wish store. Yes, you heard me correctly. And I know what you're probably thinking of. You're probably like, there's just no way Wish has a store in my city. There's no way you just pull up and you see that beautiful blue logo. And you're probably correct. Because it's not an actual Wish store. They just have associates. That's I think what we can call them. Basically stores that are hooked up to Wish and you can buy items on Wish, pay for them through Wish, and then just pick them up at the store a couple hours later. You don't gotta be waiting a whole three months for this delivery. So I went on Wish and there was actually way more stores that had this option than I thought they would. You just click on this little thing and there it shows you your local stores and all the things that are available to purchase. There is a lot of weird things that are sold at places you wouldn't think they would sell them. I settled for this little kit to remove blackheads, which just sounds amazing. Something I've always wanted. That was sold by a florist. What do blackheads have to do with flowers? You tell me, ma'am. I am not asking questions here because I only had to pay $2 I paid with my Apple Pay and then they sent me a QR code and with this QR code I was on my merry way to pick up my item. Hi, I bought something on this. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. I'll get you in just a second. Hi. Pull it up. Yeah, I have the QR. Great. Perfect. Just take a sec to open up the software. Okay, fine. Alright, got it. I'm ready. Go ahead and take the oh, screen. Yeah. <laughs> One package, right? Yeah. Six and a half hours later. One eternity later. Found it. Oh, yay. <laughs> okay, perfect. Yeah. What is it? <laughs> what do you want? Thank you so much. I don't have to do anything. Nope. I'll just confirm pick up here. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Bye. That store definitely lived up to its wish expectation. It took forever for them to give me this. It was misplaced somewhere. And by the way, when I walked in, they were like, oh, this is the wish person. I don't think a lot of people are placing wish orders and picking them up in store. So I kind of assumed they would have already known where this was because they already knew someone was coming for it, but they didn't. It's okay. They were very nice. And now I have my item. Let me open it up. I need to get all my black hats ready. Oh, yes. Look at this, a whole kit. Blackheads be gone. Honestly, I am very happy. This whole thing for $2 and I could just pick it up real fast. Yes, Wish. Heck, number two. So on Wish, they actually sell free items. I don't know if I should call this sell, but they have free items. You literally just have to pay for shipping and the item itself is free. That sounds amazing. I was like, okay, what can I find that's free here? So I typed up free. That's what I always want to pay. And a bunch of things came up. Some gloves came up i was like yes ppe we need you come here i don't got gloves a concealer palette some lashes a face mask i was like oh i am winning at life or so i thought bad news first that's just how i like to do it just take a little heart attack and then maybe receive some good news not always just maybe half of these items did not show up they just keep saying they're coming the tracking just keeps getting updated it always tells you it'll be here tomorrow and then tomorrow it says it'll be here the day after tomorrow and then next week it's just frustrating. If you're gonna get here in 2021, then just tell me that. Just be honest. Like, I've been honest with everyone. I'm never leaving my house again. There you guys go. Realistic expectations. But for the good news, we did receive some items. So I got the concealer palette. This is extremely lightweight. It literally feels like it's empty. But it looks cute. We got our concealers right there. You have a whole rainbow of colors. You got some this bright pink. Not really sure what you're using it for, but okay, that's what you do you do you we got some green some color correcting action this is definitely not creamy it has no sun which is good i feel like it's not the worst concealer not super high coverage but hey it was free and it actually got here 
And I also got this face mask, which I mean, yes, I am very happy with this. It says it's a sports mask with exhalation balls. We need to exhale. We gotta breathe. Nowadays, <laughs> this is what this mask looks like. Kind of looked like underwear to me for a second there. That's apparently where my mind is at. So you can put this on right here. And there you go. You protect it. Costco ready. We got two out of four. For Wish, that's a complete win. Hack number three. You can get mystery boxes from Wish. So I went on Wish and I started looking for mystery boxes. For some reason, I had a really hard time finding these. I don't know, maybe because I'm not a Wish connoisseur. Connoisseur, honey. However, I did end up finding a mystery bag. And I was like, mm, okay, I'm gonna secure the bag. Yes, <laughs> add to cart. This says it's worth $10. Fine, you only pay $1.95, but that's saying right there that it's a $10 item. So I'm like, all right, yes, Wish. Okay, come through. And I received this in the mail and I was quite confused. This is what I got. Well, if this is a mystery, I don't like no mysteries. Just stop being mysterious, Wish, because what is this? I don't want to explore. I don't want to find out what the surprise is about. But let's open it up. You guys, this is kind of sad. When you expect a whole mystery box and then this is what you get. Basically 2020, my plans versus what actually happened. That's just not cute. So inside, it looks empty, but it's not, I think. Oh, there you go. You get yourself a nice little ring. This is what the ring looks like. <laughs> it's like a little shiny ring. Let's see if it fits my finger. Ooh, almost. <gasps> Sir, I think it's a cute ring. Kind of giving me engagement ring vibes. And you know, it's not about the ring. It's about the love. So I guess I will. Did I just say yes to marry myself? That's disturbing. Uh, uh, uh. Hack number four. So Wish is not only for shady, weird little items. You can also buy actual little legit designer products on there. Yes, you can get anything on Wish. You can get knockoff. You can be scammed trying to buy Gucci, which of course has happened to me. I will leave a link to that video. But recently, Wish added a section where you can buy authentic, the real deal. Authenticity is what we're all about here at Wish.com. So I ended up finding this for such, for such perfume for $15. And I don't know. I don't know how legit this is, to be honest. Oh my God, it's so tiny. It better be legit. This is the world's smallest bottle of perfume. With shipping, it ended up being $29 and it wouldn't give me no other shipping option. It wouldn't tell me, well, if you want it by 2025, you could just pay $3 less. Shipping was just that expensive. So let me smell this. Oh, wish. I thought I was gonna have a tiny spray bottle. This is such a wish thing to do. It looks pretty legit. Oh my God, you guys. I just Googled this thing and you can get this for $9 dollars on Walmart. Excuse you wish. You could also get it for $18 on Sephora.com. I actually ended up paying more by going to Wish. Sir, no more name brands for me. Hack number five. So as you guys might know, Wish has a pretty bad reputation for things just getting lost, never arriving to its destination. And apparently they're trying to change that. So now if your Wish item is lost or it doesn't arrive or you're just trying to say it doesn't, customer service is really good and they'll go ahead and just refund you. That's what the legend says. Now what reality says. Mm. So I tried to talk to Wish customer service and tell them I hadn't received my Versace. Just because if I was gonna get a refund, might as well be on my Versace. And let me tell you, Wish customer service, they savage. Straight up savage. Here was their lovely reply. Please file a police complaint. Police complaint. They want receipts. Seats. Now Wish is not playing. They were not about to refund me those $15. Wish knows if you don't got receipts, it didn't happen. Hack number six. So you can have a Wish referral code and people can shop with that and then you get $5 for every person that makes a purchase. But you guys are probably like, Mar, excuse me. And I know I don't have friends either. Nobody's gonna be using my referral code. Which is why the hack is to input your code onto retail me not. And once you have done so, when people are looking for Wish discounts, they will be able Able to use yours. See the power of the internet. You don't gotta know people. You don't gotta have friends. So I tried to use my code on Retail Me Not, and I guess Retail Me Not just did not get the memo. They do not understand that we want our discounts, but we don't got any people to give our referral code to. So that was a fail. I guess technically you could still use your code with people you guys know, but if you don't know no one, then this hack just useless. But here's my code, just in case you guys want to use it. Let me live. I have to shoot my shot. But you guys, there you have 
have it. I hope you enjoyed these wish hacks. Don't forget, I've done hacks for literally everything, so go check them out. And yeah, guys, let me know if these work for you. I will be checking back in three months to see if you've received your items. I love you guys so much. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.